tackle my to-do list with me. We're going to be completing my Monday to-do list together to give you guys an idea of what it looks like for me working by myself, for myself, and what I do in a day to feel productive as a content creator and brand owner. And the sponsor of today's video is Fiverr. Thank you so much, Fiverr, for sponsoring this video. We're going to talk more about them in a few minutes, but they are an amazing resource for small business owners. I've been using them for years and I can't wait to share more about them. First, let's outline the to-do list for today. Again, you guys know I do write it down daily in my planner, but for the sake of the video so that you can easily check it off with me as we go, we got it on my phone on just the notes app. So the first thing on my to-do list today was to work out, which actually I did this morning before getting ready. I think starting your day with a quick little morning routine, whether it takes 30 minutes, whether it takes an hour, is a great way to get yourself set up for success on your busy days. So had my workout, made myself a healthy, yummy breakfast, got ready since I knew I'd be filming today, and now we're ready to sit down and tackle the rest of the to-do list. So I also need to do some email marketing, um, get campaigns set up for the whole month of August. I need to edit a YouTube video. I do have a coffee meeting at 2 p.m., so in a few hours. I'll need to pack and ship orders for my business and run those to the post office. I also just need to catch up on emails from the weekend. Mondays are usually an email heavy day because I gotta get the week started, send out emails that need to go out and respond to ones that came in over the weekend. And then lastly, these two things I don't have to get done, but if I have extra time, I would love to edit some photos and social media videos, and then also work on product development for Dream Daily. One thing I do love about working from home is I can kind of set the mood in my apartment. So make myself a coffee, light a candle, put a nice cozy display on my TV with some instrumental jazz, and just set the mood for a workplace that feels comforting and productive. Let's get started. <laughs> email marketing. Like I've mentioned in the past, email marketing isn't my strong suit. And when there's a task in my business that isn't something I'm an expert at, or I don't feel comfortable doing, or I know that there's someone that can do it better, I hire a freelancer. And that's why I'm so excited that Fiverr is sponsoring this video because Fiverr is a platform that connects you with professional freelancers on a range of digital services. Take a look at all these different skills that you can find a freelancer in graphic design, digital marketing, writing and translation, video and animation, music and audio, programming and tech, business and lifestyle. Whatever digital project you have going on, I bet you can find a freelancer that will be an amazing help to you and your project. I actually discovered Fiverr in high school, which is super cool because even though I was young and didn't have a ton of expertise in what I was doing, I knew that I could outsource the things that I maybe hadn't learned yet in business to a professional through Fiverr. And so I've been a fan of this site for years. I'm always recommending it to people who are starting businesses like me. If you're a budding entrepreneur or business owner. It is such an amazing resource. So I went searching on Fiverr for someone who specializes in email marketing with either Flowdesk or Clavio, which is the two platforms I use for my business dream daily. And I came across this freelancer, Jewel. Her professionalism is outstanding. She responds within a few hours. She's asking amazing questions to get to know my brand and what I'm needing from her. And she turned around the deliverables in a, just a couple of days. I'm gonna be working with her over the course of August too. So Jewel is helping me with an email template setup. She's creating six emails for me so that I can reach my target audience. I can convert abandoned carts into customers and just have a monthly email template ready to go. She's also going to integrate my all the places I have my email subscribers from MailChimp to Shopify to Flowdesk all into Clavio, which is the new software I'm using, and help me integrate it with Shopify so that all my products from Shopify show up in the emails. This is the abandoned cart email sequence that she provided for me. Well, I just gave her the copy and she set them up completely, integrated it with Shopify so you see 
the abandoned cart pop up and it's accurate and she made it so that the abandoned cart email sent so many hours or so many days after someone actually abandons their cart on my website. It's super cool and it saved me hours of work, hours of contacting the Clavio Help Center for things that I can't figure out and she just did it so seamlessly. Also, the community of business owners review the freelancers, so you can sift through different freelancers' reviews and find one that's going to work best for you and your business and your budget. I'm so excited to continue working with Jewel, and I'm so thankful that Fiverr allowed us to meet and work together all digitally without ever even having to hop on a call or meet in person. So head to fiverr.co slash Hannah Ashton, the link will be in the description box, and get 10% off with code Hannah Ashton. So make sure to take advantage of this and find the perfect freelancer for you. So I'm going to keep messaging with Jewel, make sure we're all set to go for my next email template she's creating for me, and I can mark that off my to-do list. apartment I packaged up my orders we have three orders going out today one to Kalina in Utah Larissa in North Dakota yeah ND North Dakota and then Tiffany in California we're gonna drop these off at the post office and to save gas and time what I do is I stack my errands and so I left the house to go to my coffee meeting but on the way I'm dropping these off at the post office and I'm gonna get to my coffee meeting a little early so that I can eat some lunch I am needing some good fuel today so I'm gonna grab some lunch out and continue with this work day I'm gonna try to get some editing done at the coffee shop as well do you guys see my inventory boxes in the back of my car my car is my warehouse just keep some extra inventory back there business and just talk about business he's a fellow Belmont student who started his business before even going to college so it was super cool to chat with him but now I'm gonna sit on the couch get a little bit comfier since it's later in the day it's now 3 30 and I'm gonna respond to some emails catch up on that and also work on maybe editing some TikToks and whatnot for the week. And then I'm gonna take a little break because I'm kind of hitting that point in the day where my brain's getting a little bit fried. So we'll take a little bit of a break and then finish some stuff up before dinner. <laughs> comfier clothes and it's about time to start winding down on work for the day it's almost six o'clock I've got dinner cooking on the stove 
and let's take a look at our to-do list. The only thing that I didn't get done that I put on here was work on some product development, but that wasn't a must do for today. So overall, I'm really happy with how much we got done on this productive Monday. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it was motivating for you to go tackle your to-do list today. I also want to remind you about my code with Fiverr. I highly recommend clicking the link in the description box and using code Hannah Ashton for 10% off. Thanks again to Fiverr for being an amazing sponsor and sponsoring this video. All right, I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Have a great week. Bye.